What's going on people, it's Greg with another Excel VBA tutorial video. Today we'll be going over how to run a macro on a protected sheet. Um, first off, shout out to MP for the idea. Alright, so let's get right into it. So I have a macro already written here, and what this macro does is it allows the user to enter a region in this cell, F2. So say I want to put Oceana, and what it'll do is it'll filter Oceana out of this data set and copy all that data over to sheet 2. So if I run it, all is well, so it works. But say I want to protect the sheets, right? So the user can't alter anything on the sheets or delete anything. Um, let's give the password, let's make it Greg123. And you see I have a locked icon here. So now if I try to do anything to any of these, I can't, all I can really do is just copy and paste at this point now. But I can't actually alter any of the data. So I'll do it with sheet two as well. So I'll protect it. Passwords Greg123. However, if I try to run the macro again, I'll get an error. So in order to have a protected sheet and still let your macro run, we'll just simply create another macro, another sub that unprotects the sheet and then protects the sheet. So we'll call this sub unprotect. And we'll say this workbook um, sheets. So the name of this sheet is sheet one. Call sheet one. And we'll say unprotect. And the password is Greg123. And then I'll also unprotect the other sheet. So this workbook sheets sheet two unprotect password is Greg one two three and now I put this sub in the beginning of my main macro so I'll just type unprotect and then at the end I want to create another another sub called protect so I'll just copy this sub and paste it here and call it protect and then change the unprotects to protect so now when I run the macro I'm good to go so there's one more thing because I protected my sheet the user can't actually put anything here so I can't change this now I'm stuck with Oceana what you can do is unprotect the sheet and then if you right click and go to format cells you can go to protection and then click uncheck this locked so now hit OK so now even if I protect the sheet this cell is free from that I can still alter it however I want you see but if I go to the other cell and try to do that it won't work so now I can put um, let's go with Eastern Europe all right so if I run the macro, it works, Eastern Europe. And we could keep going, we could do Near East. Good to go. And the user can't alter anything, can't mess up your formulas or anything like that. However, the macro store runs. So yeah, that's all I got. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Have a good one.